Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So Microsoft has already started to update some of the legacy aspects of the Windows operating system to match the look and feel of Windows 11. And as many of you would know, the task manager would be a good example of that. And another simple yet um, legacy aspect of the operating system that Microsoft has updated, although it still doesn't support dark mode, uh, is a legacy aspect like the device manager, which now carries support for the marker and marker effect in the title bar, which is unavailable on Windows 10. So just two very basic examples of legacy aspects that Microsoft has and is updating to match that of Windows 11. Now on that note, earlier this um, week, Microsoft rolled out their last and latest Dev Channel Insider Preview Build 25267. And um, I did post on that and I'll leave a link to that video in the description. But since that original rollout of uh, that a latest preview build to the Dev Channel Insiders this week. Microsoft has since updated their release notes on the 15th of December where they have added a new feature now to build 25267 where they have updated the Windows Security Firewall notification dialogs to match the Windows 11 visuals. So once again, just another example where Microsoft is trying to update legacy aspects of the operating system to match that of Windows 11. Now, obviously the Windows Security Firewall Notification menu is not the greatest feature to so-called uh, write home about, but nonetheless it does indicate that Microsoft is intent on updating the legacy aspects of the operating system. And yeah, we can see a more modern look and feel, um, a simpler design, and obviously a, a, a lot more spacing between aspects of the menu, obviously suited better for touchscreen users and touchscreen devices. Now, although it has received um, a visual upgrade, um, there is a feature here that I don't think some users would really find and be too keen about where you've got to click on show more now to get to basic functions like public networks and private networks when this menu does um, pop up obviously for options you want to enable and disable. So although it looks a little bit better or and maybe looks a bit more modern, um, you still now have to go through extra steps and extra options, um, which Microsoft seems intent on doing in Windows 11 to get to basic functions and legacy aspects. So um, has received a visual upgrade, but does require a, a couple of extra steps. And um, as mentioned, is more suited now for touchscreen and touchscreen users with a bit more of a wider spacing between those aspects of the menu. But as mentioned, uh, not the greatest feature to maybe update, but nonetheless does give us an indication that Microsoft is updating legacy aspects of the Windows operating system to match that and the look and feel of Windows 11. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.